everyone, it's Bonnie. Happy Friday night. I've got one more video for you guys tonight. Oh my gosh. I'm going to talk about Red Velvet Cupcake from Bath & Body Works. i got Christmas cards to share with you. And then I'm going to sign off because we are watching a movie tonight. Uh, we all kind of decided uh, that we're going to watch National Treasure tonight. I don't know why I'm in the mood for National Treasure. It's one of my favorite movies. My mom bought some popcorn from Trader Joe today. I'm excited. So I'm just going to kind of chill out and relax with the family after this. But first, we got a lot to talk about. So Christmas cards. Um, I'm getting all these Christmas cards in. Thank you so much. I usually send my Christmas cards out early, like as they come in, I send some out. I, I'm doing it different this year. I think I'm going to send them out all at once, um, mainly because I ordered stickers and return address labels that have not arrived yet. They're supposed to be here like in the next couple of days. So I'm like, I hope they get here. Um, I'm going to give you a sneak peek at the back of this year's Christmas card. I won't show the front. I won't ruin the surprise. Uh, but I did something super sparkly on the back of the Christmas card. So I can't wait to get those out for you. I am saving all the envelopes so that I can send Christmas cards out. I got a whole bunch of Christmas cards in in the last couple days. I'm going to share these. Look at this. This is so cute. Look, it says Bonnie. I love the bee. Um, this is from uh, Diane, and she also sent me coupons. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much, Diane. I'm taking these coupons tomorrow so that I can buy more stuff for Body Care Day. I'm so excited. She sent me two sets of coupons. One is already in my wallet. <laughs> So thank you so much, Diane. Um, next up, kindness makes the holiday even brighter. This card is so beautiful. It's textured. This is from uh, Cherry. Thank you so much. This is beautiful. I don't know why. This card really just stood out to me with how pretty it is. Um, next up, look at how cute this is. This is from Cami. Uh, she also sent me uh, some adorable little stickers. Thank you, Cami, for this. That is so cute. Um, Oh my gosh, I love this card too. I love all Christmas cards. I love this one with the plaid snowman. Um, this is from, oh my gosh, I'm terrible reading cursive anymore. Um, Joseph? Oh my gosh, I feel so terrible. Tell me your name, whoever sent me this card. Um, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm terrible at reading cursive, I swear. That should be taught in schools more. My, my daughter can't even write cursive. Cursive is like a, a dying art that they should bring back. <laughs> uh, happy holidays. I love this one with the adorable little penguin. Oh my gosh. Um, this one from Melissa. Thank you so much, Melissa. Um, oh my gosh, look at this card. I love this one so much. It's like an old timey car with the Christmas tree. This is from Deborah and Larry. Thank you so much, Deborah and Larry. Um, oh my gosh, I love this one. Let's pause and celebrate the season. So cute. Um, this is from Joyce. Thank you so much, Joyce. I love this poodle, by the way. This poodle is just making me happy. And then I got uh, Mary and Bright. You guys are awesome. Look at this card, Mary and Bright. This is from Jamie, Alex, and Jewel. How adorable is that? Thank you so much for the Christmas cards. These are being hung up. Uh, there's still time to send a card. If you want to send a card, uh, it's Bonnie, at Queen of the Girl Geeks, P.O. Box 1224, Mentor, Ohio, 44061. I have the address below, too. Um, I also want to mention quickly, um, I get so upset with um, spammers. So a couple people had mentioned they were getting um, text messages and someone was using my picture. I'm like, no, not cool. And saying um, that they won something from me. Um, just to let you know, that is not how I do any contests. I don't do random contests um, and text people or message people on Instagram. Um, I don't like DM anyone like that. I'm like, oh my gosh. They, these spammers have been doing horrible. Every time I ran a contest um, or a giveaway, what they would do on my YouTube channel is they would leave a message on every single person's um, 
comment and they'd be like, oh, hey, it's Bonnie, you won. And then call at this number. I don't even know what they're trying to do, honestly. I'm like, I have no idea what these spammers, if they're just trying to get like phone numbers or whatever. Um, so I haven't really been doing any giveaways lately because the spammers are really, really bad right now. If I do a giveaway, the only way I do giveaways is on my YouTube channel. I clearly announce what I'm giving away, the time frame, and how I will be contacting you. So if you get a message from someone pretending to be me, it's not me. <laughs> I just want to, like, it's it's horrible what, what you know, because they use my picture and it's so easy to go, oh, I get a message from Bonnie. Um, no. So, um, yeah, I'm going to hold off a little bit. Uh, the giveaways are fun. I like doing giveaways, but um, it's just not worth it to bring all the spam to the channel. So, oh my gosh, that's that's like the, the downer I had to talk about. <laughs> like, I don't want to talk about spammers, so I want to talk about candles. I want to talk about Red Velvet Cupcake, which is one of my all-time favorite candles. It's funny because I don't think everyone loves Red Velvet Cupcake. Um, it's kind of a light candle. This was an online exclusive this year, and actually it's sideways. Um, it is beautiful. I love it. I think it's wonderful. Usually they bring this out like for candle day and they brought this out earlier this year. They brought it out with a uh, pink fairy gumdrop. Um, what else was in this collection? They're, they're like sold out now, which is disappointing. Oh, they had um, caramel drizzle. Is this the one? Um, no, salted caramel. I got to review this one. Um, but I loved, I love the collection. It was so cute. I love the whimsical kind of like, designs. I love the color palette. Absolutely beautiful. I love Red Velvet Cupcake. And as many of you know that have been watching me for years and years, uh, you know I love mint chocolate, which they have not brought back. Um, creamy Nutmeg is usually in this collection. A lot of people thought Tipsy Elf was Creamy Nutmeg, which I'm hearing is back online. I didn't even look. But hopefully we get a better candle sale soon so we can start getting more of these um, post-candle day candles. And it would be really nice if they restocked that online collection, um, like the Pink Fairy Gumdrop and the Red Velvet Cupcake. Where'd my note go? Um, set notes in Red Velvet Cupcake, Lush Red Cake, Lush Red Cake, uh, Creamy Frosting, and uh, Sweet Vanilla. It's basically like a cakey buttercream frosting. I love this one so much. I've had this going uh, a little over an hour now. Um, every year... I burn red velvet cupcake. I usually try and keep one at the top of my collection because sometimes I just want one even in the summer. Um, I love red velvet cupcake. It is on the light side. This is not a powerhouse. It's not going to fill your room. It's good in the kitchen or if you've got it in, you know, closer proximity to you, um, you're going to smell it, but it's not strong. But it is, it is literally one of my favorite Bath and Body Works candles just because I love the pureness of the vanilla in this one and the cake. It's so, so good. So anyway, um, let me know. Do you, do you like Red Velvet Cupcake? Um, usually it gets bad reviews. <laughs> I'm like the, I'm like the Red Velvet Cupcake champion here and I hope they keep bringing it back, but they have to bring back mint chocolate too. Anyway, oh my gosh, you guys have an awesome Friday night. Thank you so much for the Christmas cards. Uh, let's hope that um, Santa brings all the spammers coal. <laughs> I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.